everyone and welcome you with Amira Ceylon and this is the energies for airy for love and relationship twin flame and soulmate reading for 2017 2017 I'm going to be using my own deck of cards Amira's love oracle cards which were channeled from spirit they are available online and they are reduced at the moment until sold out they're a great deck to use for any question but especially for love and relationship I've pre-shuffled the cards. I'm using a different microphone today as I've been having a problem with sound recently. So hopefully the sound is a lot better than it has been in other readings I've done. And um, you can have a look at the cards and see how we go. And um, hopefully things will be a lot very clear to you as we go through. Okay, I've done a, a spread which is my own invention. It's called a seven card story. So I've pre-shuffled the cards and these are the cards I've got for Aries for energy for 2017 for love relationship. So the first card here is the friendship card. So I'm going to read this um, in specific ways of the whole reading for specific ways of being for same sex relationship, married people, single people and um and heterosexual relationship so let's see how we go with everything so starting off we have friendship so if you are single and looking for relationship it could be very well possible that you are going to meet somebody through a friend through networking over the internet an introduction of some description I'm also going to tie everything together at the end and bring in some channeled messages for you as well Aries the next thing we have is money. So it looks like finances and money are looking good this year, as well as around relationships. So you could be with somebody who is financially stable. You might be talking about finances with somebody. You meet my, might meet somebody if you are single through a financial transaction or interaction. You could be going for a loan. You could be speaking to a banker. You could be um, purchasing a car or selling a car or something like that. So there could be a money aspect here for you around your relationships this year, Aries. And it could be if you are already in a relationship, you could have a very strong bond with this person already as a friend and also have um, something to do with them financially, joint finances and things like that. So that's a nice one for you. So abundance and prosperity around your relationships this year. Now, we've got a soulmate um, card here as well for you. So what this is telling me is, is that if you are already in a relationship, you're in a soulmate relationship. If you're looking for a relationship, then you have a soulmate definitely coming in around you. Okay, so I do feel that there is a soulmate potential here, a soulmate connection. And often soulmates are brought into our lives to learn lessons, to grow and evolve spiritually and um, as human beings in general. So that's always a nice thing to remember. Now we've got the gossip card. The gossip card is about hearing about someone through the grapevine. It's hearing gossip about someone or something. It's about a warning not to get involved in too much gossip areas this year regarding relationship and what other people are saying maybe about your relationship and keeping out of um, talking too much maybe to your girlfriends about certain things that are going on for you. you. They might not be able to give you the right advice that you need or it could even be male friends, the right advice that you need regarding a specific relationship that you have or that you're getting yourself into. Then we've got the dark male. Now he's dark for his cultural background. So if he's Caucasian, then he's got dark hair, dark eyes. And he covers a lot of different um, variations of, of um, the dark male in different cultures from the East India, Asia, all of the Asian culture mainly have dark hair, dark eyes, South Americans mainly, except for some people who might be from a, a Northern European background in South America. But most South Americans and Central Americans have dark hair, dark eyes, a lot of people in also Western countries and, and also the whole continent of Africa. So there we go with that one. Um, except for maybe some of the Northern African places, they have lighter colored eyes. So dark male, so he's dark for his cultural background. He, you might find him very attractive. He could be also you if you are the Aries and you are the dark male. Um, so he's looking very swarthy. He's looking very debonair indeed. And um, we've got union here. So it's a serious relationship. We've got you coming together with someone, soulmate, friendship, introduction, 
hearing about someone through the grapevine could be the dark male if it's not yourself it could be the dark male coming in around you and he is and or he is involved with you or you are the person that is going to get involved with someone for a serious relationship if you're not already married and in a relationship because this is confirming a very strong bond if you are a married Aries a very strong bond for 2017 and for your relationships or marriage partner so this is marriage serious relationship committed relationship this is looking really really nice Aries so if you have been with somebody and you're looking to take it to the next step this is saying that you could very well get married this year or be in a committed relationship you might even be talking about children if you don't have children already of your own so the children will be a highlight for you if you don't have children and don't want children this could very well be looking at the world through childlike eyes this could also be meeting somebody from your childhood or through a childhood friend or location in your childhood so it could be going back home to where you were born it might be able to shift some energy around your relationships just by revisiting and reconnecting with the place even if there's no one there that you know anymore it could be just a reconnection but for most of you it's going to be talking about children in your life so most people do have children and it's the children that are around a serious relationship so this is a nice one for you Aries it's a fairly straightforward simple type of um, uncomplicated feel to it this year for you around your relationships I am picking up an L sounding initial like a Lenny Lenora Laureen Loretta Laurie Larry um, first or second name could be male or female Laura so I'm picking up an L sounding initial for you prominent could be around the relationship or it could be one of your children or somebody or somebody that you actually go out with and date if you are single so I'm picking up an L initial for you for 2017 this year not I don't like you to get too fixated on the name so just take it as it comes it may or may not make sense to you in the beginning it might not resonate 100% for you in the beginning and it might be clearer to you later on because some people do have second and third names that um, are, are unknown to you could also be somebody around them in spirit too like a father a mother figure that type of thing too so overall areas I feel like things are moving forward for you for 2017 your love life things are looking very consolidated I do feel you're with your twin your soulmate relationship not necessarily your twin flame but a soulmate relationship that you've got a very strong friendship there's abundance flowing around the relationship so it could very well also be that this person is very good for you for creating prosperity and abundance in your life and together you might be actually doing some sort of a business or a deal or working together in some way or creating more abundance together in some way the only warning here is is not to get too involved in gossip don't believe everything you hear don't um, invest yeah don't um, believe gossip about from females especially I'm picking up and if it is about the dark male and his past it's always best to, to talk to him directly about something I feel like there could be some jealousy around you to do with this relationship and that's why the gossip is there it's not something that you would normally get involved with Aries but I do feel that it could be something around the relationship there's some gossip there that could be jealousy from third parties that really have nothing to do with you and the relationship itself you're going to be looking at having children or getting more involved with the children that are already in your life you're going to be consolidating this marriage or relationship that you're already in or forming this year or actually getting married so 2017 is looking very positive for you Aries and thank you for subscribing sharing and google plusing my um, videos and by subscribing to my channel you get automatically notified when I do publish new videos for you specifically if you would like to look at your rising sign and moon sign that will probably add some light or shed some light for you to have a look at um, different variables for this year for your love life because sometimes we can operate more from our rising sign or moon sign so that's always really nice if you see the links below in the show more section 
below this video, you can see the different links and of how to connect with me. Also the link for my cards as well and um, anything else you'd like to um, connect with me about. There are, uh, there's links for Facebook, Google, uh, Facebook, Google+, Plus, Twitter, Instagram. And um, on my Facebook page, I do give away prizes on a regular basis. So thank you so much for um, everything and your attention and your support too. Ciao for now.